In this video, we're going to look at how to change the properties of your pages in Google Sites. So I've clicked on the Pages tab over in the little panel, the right-hand panel here, and you see the different pages are down there. As I move the mouse over different pages, you've got the three dot menus on the right-hand side. So if I want to change the properties, for example, the Arduino, I want to click on the drop-down here, and these are the things I can do. I can set it as the home page, which I don't want to do. That means it's the launching page that you actually your website comes in on. I can duplicate it, especially if you've got something set up um, that you want to use a very similar layout, you probably would duplicate it. Let's talk about the actual properties themselves, come back to that in a second. We can add a sub page, um, we can hide this from the navigation, which means it won't show up in our navigation thing, and we can actually delete the page as well. If we go into properties, you can also change the name of it so it becomes some other name, which we're not going to worry about. Now, what I'm going to be concerned is I actually want to hide these from navigation. So I don't want those to be there. Um, this is really useful if you've got a page and a structure in that you haven't yet um, put the information in. You can actually just hide it so it won't actually be displayed when you present this to the world, when you publish it out to the world. So that's how you go about changing the prop page properties in Google Sites.